I will purple spell you down in this store. <laughs> like, please get away from me. If I had one wish, we would be fast friends. One wish, one wish, one wish. Hey y'all. <laughs> so today is Tuesday. And I just pulled up at Ross because I'm about to go in here and see if they have um a, like bathroom door hanger. Uh because I need something to like hang towels and my like robes and stuff like that on um so i'm about to run in here real quick yesterday was a monday today i just uploaded the vlog i haven't uploaded a vlog in two weeks so y'all got like two weeks worth of footage um so i just uploaded that i really like the vlog i actually watched the whole thing myself <laughs> so i hope that y'all like it just as much as i liked it because i actually really like that vlog um, I finally like got out, so we got a little action in the vlog. You know, most of the time I don't be doing that, I be chilling. But I got out, so yeah. If you haven't watched that vlog, make sure you go watch it. Um, so I'm about to run in here real quick. After this, um, I need to go to the grocery store. This is how I started out the last vlog at the grocery store. But I don't think I'm gonna film going to the grocery store now like that. I just know that's something that I need to do. And also, I already have the video filmed, edited, and stuff that I'm ed uploading this week as well that I'm going to upload on Thursday. Since the vlog didn't go up until today, which is Tuesday, I'm not going to post again until Thursday because these are my uploading days. So, um, basically, my work or whatever for the week is done. I'm probably going to go out and take some pictures this week, though, um, like a little bit of content for Instagram or something. But yeah, that's about it. Um, this is the last vlog that y'all see me with these braces, though. So, <laughs> cause I get my braces off next week. I'm so happy. So yeah, y'all make sure y'all enjoy these last few little um, this last little footage of me with these braces. This is the last time. Why do I feel like I just got like kind of nauseous? Where do I get nauseous from? I don't, let me run in this store real quick so I can get back home. Hey y'all, so today is Wednesday and I just left uh, Walmart. I had to come out because I'm cooking tonight. I'm cooking, I was supposed to cook yesterday but I'm gonna just cook today and I'm making some taco salad. I don't know if he's still gonna want taco salad or if he's gonna want the spaghetti. But I'm cooking one of those. More than likely the taco salad though. Cause I kinda have more so of a taste for taco salad than spaghetti. But you know, every time I'm out, like it just makes me realize like how hard it is for girls these days. Cause it's like it's real life creeps out here and it's just like you never know if a man is being like a creep or, hold on y'all, I'm trying to get this freaking camera together. <clears throat> there we go. So like I was saying, it's like, you never know if a man is like being a creep or if they're just asking like real questions that they just need to ask, you know? And nowadays it's just like, I don't know, like me, I try not to be like this snotty, rude person, but then again, I don't be wanting to seem like I'm just one of them naive type of girls that's just, I don't know. Like, if you get what I'm saying, like, I don't know. I be like, I try not to be rude, but then again, it's just like, I don't know. Men just kind of creep me out, period. <laughs> like, it was this man, I was in Walmart, and this man, first he came up, first he came up it was like other people i mean it was like kind of other people but i know on another aisle like it was these um older it was an older couple older white couple and um 
this man, uh, older man, they were like talking or whatever. It wasn't too far from like the aisle that I was, or I wasn't even on the aisle, I was like in the open. And I was looking for some hangers in Walmart and, no, I was actually looking at some blankets. And he came up, he was like, you don't have to know anything about dying, do you? I was like, no. Um, okay, so cool, fine, whatever. Then I'm on the next aisle, like it's a few minutes later and I'm looking for some hangers and I'm on the aisle by myself and then he comes back around and he's like, he was like mumbling, he's like, this is um, uh, the type of lady that knows what she wants or something like that and then he gonna come up and say, you just moving into your place? And I was like, no, because, sir, don't do that like don't don't do that because i will prep or spray you down in this store <laughs> like please get away from me and don't make me call my man because then we'll have a bigger problem <laughs> like seriously i was so t so tempted to like call him and just like tell him to stay on the phone with me while i was in the store because I didn't like he was just being weird but I don't want to call him because I know he's gonna like make like he's gonna be like overboard and be like over dramatic <laughs> but, <laughs> so I know to only call him when it's like serious like if he would have came back around and continued to be on some creep stuff yet yeah, then I would have had a call but it's just like it's just so sad how girls have to move like we have to walk around like being so cautious everywhere we go it's just so sad it's so sad because it's real life creeps out here okay y'all so i am making tacos and right now the meat is Simmering or whatever. This is my first time making tacos, so I really hope they come out good. And my camera just totally like. Okay, there we go. She's clearing back out. But I'm not even. Well, I'm not even making like tacos. I'm making taco salad. So same difference, right? But right now I have my time for 20 minutes, so I'm gonna let the meat cook and the sauce seasoning whatever you want to call it for a good 20 minutes and then i mean i'll be done so if this come out right then we're gonna add this number two to the list that i know how to make so we got pasta and then well chicken pasta and then we're gonna have tacos on the list so well both of these are like so easy i need to get more and then i plan on trying to make some spaghetti I got the stuff for the spaghetti. So I'm gonna try to make spaghetti. Now that's a little different because I don't have to cut up onions and the you know, peppers and all that. So that's a little bit more, you know, cooking, cooking. Like you actually gotta do a little work. So then we'll have three things. Hopefully these come out good. I did I just say oh we're not doing tacos, we're doing taco salad. So I mean, we should be fine. I hope so. I have my music playing, girl. Like, period. <laughs>
Take it to my man. <laughs> hey y'all. Okay, so today is Thursday and we really just been chilling, cleaning up today. But right now we're about to go try this new place. I'm really excited because it's actually like a co it's a coffee shop or a coffee cafe, whatever you want to call it. But they look like they have like really nice food and they serve breakfast, lunch, and dinner uh, all throughout the day. Um, so we're about to go try that. I'm really excited because I feel like it's going to be really good and it's so pretty. Like the way they set up the food and everything is really pretty. So yeah, we're about to go do that. Last time I was, <laughs> when I was on here last night, I was cooking and we was eating. One thing about it, we going to eat, okay? Now we're back from um, the little place or whatever. The place turned out to be really good, y'all. I got an iced coffee. Well, I got a vanilla iced latte. It was so pretty. Like, this is what it looks like. It was really good. Probably, yeah, it's kind of watered down now. I could actually probably add some creamer to it. Because it has some creamer in there. In the refrigerator. Probably do that so I can finish it off. But... It actually turned out to be really good. Um, I ended up getting a womelet. So it's like an omelet, but they make it in a waffle maker. So it's an omelet just made in a waffle maker or whatever. Get from over there. So, um, yeah, I got that. And then also we got some cinnamon rolls. And then babe got... Um, Oh, chicken and waffles, and he really liked those. Or he really liked it. So, yeah, I'm so happy that we found a new little spot. It was really good. Um, so, yeah. Because I said I want to start trying, like, a lot of new coffee shops and stuff. So, I'm really excited to try more coffee shops. I want to try some matcha from some places. Like, I just really want to get into, like, trying little new coffee shops and stuff. Because I don't know, like, coffee shops just really be, like, a good vibe, you know? Like, it's quiet in there. They just be playing, like, music. Like, it's just a nice little vibe. So, I'll probably, like, start, like, I'm going to start, like, going to coffee shops and stuff to, like, work. Like, edit whenever it's time for me, like, edit videos and all that kind of stuff. Because, you know, like, working from home and doing YouTube and stuff, like, our job is basically at home. So... I just need to like find new places to get out and like work from being in the house all the time. Like the only time I really go out is, okay, yeah, if we go out and do something, you know, stuff like that. But I don't know. I just really need to start getting outside. I would rather be like out, you know, because I'm always in the house. So um, right now, well, I uploaded the video today. I uploaded the get ready. Well, it was the everyday makeup routine, but I was like doing the little, um, like opening up and telling y'all about me type thing or whatever. And right now I'm like, it's like a lot of good feedback, like the comments and everything. So I'm really glad that like I could be a help to other people and just let other people know that we're all human and we human and we all go through, you know, times or whatever. And you know, sometimes you do just need, like, a break from social media. Like, social media is just very... It can be too much sometimes, you know? So, I'm just really happy that um, it's touching the people that it needs to touch. Um, but, yeah. Uh, I'm probably just about to chill for the rest of the night, honestly. Um, yeah. And I think this vlog I'm going to do, I'm going to make it like the next two weeks. 
vlog like or like i'm gonna make it another two week vlog so instead of uploading this vlog on sunday it's gonna go up in two weeks so we're gonna do this week and next week combined i think that's what i want to do so good morning y'all so today is november 1st and i am currently on the way to my orthodontist because i'm actually getting my um braces off today so it is the first of my month and god has already blessed me on the first of my month so y'all know i'm excited to see my birthday is on november 22nd happy scorpio season but let me just tell you when november 22nd comes it's over okay it's over but yeah if y'all have been following me since i got my braces y'all probably remember when i was like just let me have my braces off by my 21st birthday and look at god like the first of the month nobody do it like him okay nobody do it like him so i'm pulling up to the orthodontist right now i'm so excited y'all but one of my brackets are actually loose like off of my tooth and this is my first time ever experiencing something like this. Like, I've never seen it. And then I just noticed it last night. So hopefully this doesn't mess anything up or anything like that as far as me getting them off today. Because, listen, I already made plans. I got my photo shoot book, all that. And I was already planning on my teeth being, you know, pearly white and bracketless. Okay, so <laughs> hopefully we stay on track with everything. We getting them off today, and whatever they need to do without them, we can just do that, <laughs> okay? So, um, I didn't get to eat anything. I'm actually running a little bit late, but I'm glad that I'm pulling up right now because as soon as we leave, I'm going to get something to eat because I'm starving. But I'm going to try to get a little footage if I can film a little bit. Um, so, yeah, I'm pulling up. And they told me, they just called me and told me I can come on in as soon as I pull up. And I just pulled up, so... Put me in the chair, cut them off, baby, snatch them off. <laughs> so, the braces are off. Y'all can even barely see me. I'm about to put on this hat because for some reason, I feel like, oh my God, the camera lighting like keeps on going in and out. Maybe I should move before and I have to sneeze. Oh, and I know I need to go to Target because I want to get this whitening kit. Oh my God. <laughs> my teeth. Anyways, I think I'm going to go to the grocery store instead of going to get some food. I'm going to go to the grocery store. I also need to go to the shop because I don't know if any of you follow me or not. But if you follow my nail page, then you know that I am relaunching my business. So, you can go ahead, baby. I am relaunching. Why am I talking weird? Oh no, oh no, no, no. Why am I talking like this? Folks get new teeth and a whole new accent. <laughs> but anyways, if you follow my nail page, then you know that I am relaunching my nail business. Um if you follow my page you're probably like super confused because i wrote this whole thing which i still be like i felt like everything is still that is still how i felt and everything i'm just you know listen i'm just letting god move me so wherever he's he gonna, wherever he do like listen i'm just going so yeah i am relaunching my nail business so i think i'm gonna go well no i probably should just go and grab some a bite to eat and then yeah because i'm yeah i'm gonna go grab a bite to eat first and then um go to the shop because i need to go to the shop and see what all i need to order i've already ordered a couple things because like i ordered all the essential stuff that i know that i need but i need to go to the shop and see like acrylic colors that i need to re-up on um disinfecting stuff like cleaning sanit sanitizing all that kind of good stuff i need to see what all i need to get again so I'm going to go and do that, but first we're gonna get something to eat, okay? I really wanna go see if I can find like a coffee shop or something. Maybe I should look up and see if they have some type of coffee shop. But then again, I probably shouldn't do that because coffee and my skin don't really get along, so 
Maybe I should just go get some matcha. I don't know. Let's go see. We're going to find something, honey child. Okay? I'm so excited. It's November. I got my freaking braces off. Like, I'm just so excited. Oh, my God. <laughs> this just, like, made me so... I don't know why, but I just feel like... Really... I feel like in good spirits you know i feel really really good about this month and the rest of this year i feel ready to like take on the world for some reason i don't know why but yeah that's what i feel like so we're gonna take on the world <laughs> Undefeated, mm-hmm, title, crazy, Bible. Oh my God, anyways, y'all, so, I wanted to show y'all this this morning, but your girl redid a room again. Well, not really, I just kind of like move stuff around. And that's my blanket. The orthodontist folks gave me a goodie bag of stuff that I supposedly couldn't eat. But I was eating. A little blanket. This throw doesn't even go with my room no more. So it was really a waste. I keep on getting all these throws that I end up doing away with. But this pompous grass right here was actually in my bathroom. But I'm going to get some black pompous grass to put in there. And I'll probably get a new vase. And then I got to get some new vines. Um, Y'all may recognize this mirror. I've been had this mirror. It was just in my old um, beauty room. But I finally brought it here to go in my room. Finally. I kind of need to re-clean it because it's like got like little smear things on it. But I just wanted to show y'all. Because I'm so happy now that I got this. And my memory is about to run out. But... Let me just put this on the charger and I meant find some storage and then I'll be. Let's go. I'm trying to get up in. I'm trying to go crazy, nigga. I'm trying to go. Mm, nope. Hey. Jesus Christ. Anyways, hey y'all. <laughs> it is what today is Tuesday. So yesterday I like really didn't even come back on camera. I didn't even do anything for your frill yesterday. And there goes Bronco. But um let me move you down a little bit. So I'm about to um go through this big old box of wigs because y'all I have so many wigs. Like, y'all know I had that wig sale, but I have so... What's in Y'all know I had that wig sale. So, I didn't even, like... It's so many left. Like, you would think that most of them was gone. Because I sold, like... How many wigs? I sold, like, 27 wigs. And I still have a whole box full of wigs. Let me show y'all. This is the box of wigs, y'all. So... I still have this full box of wigs. See? And it's heavy. That I need to go through. 
sort out, see which ones I want to sell, and to go ahead and like wash them because the last time I sold them first, and then as they like sold, sorry y'all, this retainer is like irritating. As they sold, I would wash them, but this time I want to go ahead and wash them beforehand because that way I can go ahead and ship it out as soon as it sells instead of like washing it having to wait on it to dry and all that like i just feel like it would be faster if i just go ahead and wash them before i even sell them or whatever so i can go ahead and send it right to you as soon as she's ready okay so or as soon as you purchase her so i think that's what i'm gonna do today i'm gonna go ahead and wash a lot of these wigs and i also don't really want to do the sale on depop again i kind of want to try to make my own website and try to sell them that way but the only thing about it is depop goes it goes ahead and creates the shipping labels for you which is like super easy so like they do like most of the work you know so then again it's like i kind of just want to stick to that but I don't know, child. I don't know. And then I put on this wig last night at like 2 o'clock in the morning. Because I was up watching TikToks and it just motivated me to get up and put on a, do my hair. Because the wig that I had on yesterday, she was done. She been through. Like, she been ready to give up. So, <laughs> I put this on. And I've already worn this wig before. But I put her back on because she's just so long and cute. Like, I love this wig so much. And I remember when I first wore her, I had took her off like super quick because, um, let me sit down. I had took it off super quick because the lace, like I didn't cut the lace short enough and it was like hurting my ear, but this time it's not really hurting. Or maybe I haven't had it on long enough or something. I don't know, but it's not hurting right now, so. I'm really happy about that because um, I really do like this week. The only thing I don't like, though, is the fact that, like, she's so far back here. I would like her to be, like, a little bit more further up on my forehead, but the way it's set up, like, it won't let me do that. And y'all see me looking over here because I'm looking into my mirror, but it, like, won't let me do that. And then... Your girl has been sitting over here like slick stressing, but I'm trying not to stress out about it because y'all know my birthday is this month. So I'm trying to get everything together like for like outfits and stuff. So I have my birthday dress. I have my birthday dress, but I have to find like my other outfit because I'm doing a photo shoot. So I have to find, I ordered stuff. And now I don't think, like, I ordered it without ordering the whole entire outfit. And now I don't even think I want to go for that anymore. Like, I don't think I want to do that anymore. So now I'm, like, trying to contemplate if, if I should just get the finishing pieces to that, that will go with that. Or just find something totally different. But I really do think that I'm trying to just, I want to find something totally different. But that's, that's this is stressing me out, trying to find something totally different. And it would just be so much easier to just throw something together like real quick to go with the other stuff that I didn't already order and I can just be done with it because I also don't want to wait until last minute then like stuff not get here on time and all that kind of stuff because all I have left to order let's see I wrote it down in my notes like still or left to get the stuff that I still need to get so I still have to get my clutch and my like bag or whatever that I'm gonna wear for like with my birthday dress I still have to get my heels that I'm gonna wear with my birthday dress I still have to get um so I have to get my birthday clutch heels and jewelry and I still have to get my it says the fit for this boy just tried to bite me in my face um uh, yeah, a little time out. But I still have to get my, it says first fit for the photo shoot or whatever. So that's basically the fit that I'm saying. Either find the little finishing pieces to go with the stuff that I already ordered or find something totally new and different. <sighs> and then I would have to find the shoes and everything to go with that. 
and then I still have to get some other stuff that go, that's to a different event because like they're right there together so I'm trying to I'm like all of that that's like all I have to focus on right now is my like outfits and It's like, bro. So I need a total of one, two, three, four. Total of four outfits. Oh, snap. And then Thanksgiving. I'm tripping. I done forgot all about Thanksgiving. Y'all, my birthday is on that Monday. Thanksgiving is on that Thursday, I think, or that Wednesday. One of those days. We're going to see. Oh, snap, Lord, jeez. Oh, maybe I could do, if I don't wear the stuff that I was saying that I had already ordered for my birthday, then maybe I could try to incorporate that into a Thanksgiving fit. But it's going to be cold. Okay, so Thanksgiving is on that Thursday. Oh, my God, y'all. This too much. Like, I don't know why I should have been waiting to the last minute. I do this every year, yo. I do this every year. Well, last year, no. Last year, I was on top of it. I had ordered all my stuff. All my stuff had came in. I was just waiting on my birthday. But. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Why must I do this to myself? But I'm about to get up. I'm probably going. I'm finna go in here and eat something real quick. It's 1:38, but I just made like some breakfast. I made some eggs and sausage and all that kind of stuff. So I made that. I'm about to go in here and eat, and then for the rest of the day, I'm gonna be figuring out this stuff for this week. So I can go ahead and do that. And then some of my stuff that I ordered for my nail stuff. Oh yeah, I didn't tell y'all that. Um, so y'all seen a little bit. I tried to get a little bit of my, my camera ended up going dead while I was at the shop. So um, I figured out, I made a list of all the stuff that I need to <laughs> Girl, this is my list of all the stuff that I need to get for if my nail stuff. So, yeah, while I was at the shop yesterday, y'all probably seen when I was, like, picking up the acrylics and all that. I was trying to see which ones was, like, low, what I need to get more of. So, I broke all my stuff down. I got acrylics, a whole list of acrylics that I need to get. I got a whole list of gels I need to get and, like, essential stuff for nails. Um, I think I need to get some more acetone, nail disinfectant spray, files. Um, I got to get some more glue for my designs, wax pen. I need to get another matte top coat, some more dehydrator, all that. I need to get all that. But the stuff that I ordered, um, like all the like essential, essential stuff I ordered, some of it has came in today and then a, some else is arriving today. Another thing is a coming, a, coming in on Thursday and uh, a gel polish that I went ahead and ordered is coming in between... It's supposed to be here. Um, is that Thursday? I think that's Thursday. The fourth? Yeah, that's Thursday. So I guess both of them should be here then, or it may be here, I guess, next week. But I went ahead and ordered some more tips, some more monomers, some more. Well, I got the gel polish, and then I got these, um, the little chrome hearts designs, because I've been wanting to do them nails for the longest. So I went ahead and ordered them. I ain't ordered. No other new designs with them chrome hearts. I made sure I get the little chrome heart decal, nail decals. And then I also ordered this dust collector thing to sit up on my table. So hopefully, because that's one thing like I really hate it when doing nails. It's like all the dust and stuff. And I just like, like, baby girl. 
I'm too cute to be like dusty like this. You know what I'm saying? So, and I just really, yeah, I know I have sensitive skin, and I feel like that dust and stuff getting on me really used to like make me break out and like irritate my skin. And I think it's this certain thing, like I even looked it up, and it was like the acrylic and all that kind of stuff. Like it could give you contact dermatitis. Is that what it's called? Yeah, it's called contact dermatitis. So yeah um that's why i got the little dust collector thing so that'll minimize the amount of dust that'll be you know shooting around flying around or whatever because it'll be like sitting there and then like basically it's like a suction i guess that's how it's working i hope so um so yeah that's the stuff that i've gotten so far but anyways i'm gonna go ahead get up go eat real quick so i can get on to these wigs because i'm not trying to be washing wigs all day I'm not no dishwasher or wig washer. right now i was trying to find my head scarf so that i could cover up or try to cover up the fact that my lace is lifting but she won't i i haven't found her in would it be ghetto or it's like not um what is it not proper etiquette would you say that if i put on a hat to talk to y'all right now i'm finna do it there we go because i can't be on camera looking a hot mess like you know and it's still giving me very much hat mess. You know what? I'm gonna just blend it, cause girl, I'm over it. Say, you say. I don't even know what I was gonna say, but. Okay, yeah, we just gonna have to do a bunny chronicle for now because sister girl, and all that kind of good stuff right now just she it's, it's not it's not messing with me right now okay so now we have a nice little setup so i just want to give y'all an update so the wigs nope i did not finish shorting through them and i did not wash nail one of them so <laughs> yeah but what i did do though is i found my outfit so I found my first full outfit um, and then because y'all know I told y'all the list of what I, I needed to get. So on my list and I got some stuff in my cart. So as long as the stuff is in my cart and I know what I'm about to get, I'm good. So I found my um, the first photo shoot outfit which was when I told y'all either find something totally new or try to find the finishing pieces of the stuff that I already got. I found something totally new and I don't know what I'm going to do with the other stuff that I already got. I may send it back. I don't know. I never send stuff back but it's kind of extra and I know I probably won't wear it like on a regular you know. So I probably should just send it back. So um, I got that. I got that outfit. All I had to do is get the shoes for it now. Um, the bag that I needed to get is in my cart. Um, I still have to get my clutch though. I still have to get my clutch and my heels that I'm gonna wear for, with my birthday dress. And I also still have to get these boots that I wanna get. So I still have to get boots, boots, birthday clutch, and heels. So, Yeah, right now in my cart, I'm pretty good. I think I'm going to just go ahead and order all this right here. Honestly, I think I'm going to just go ahead. I 
I think I'm just gonna head and cancel out right here. This should be everything. I'm trying to see. Let me make sure. And then I have a scarf in my cart. I'm trying to see if I want to do this scarf or find another scarf because I kind of want the scarf. It's a houndstooth, houndstooth print scarf, but it has like a black. And I'm on shit, y'all. It has this like black little. Hold on, when it focus. That little part right there. I kind of want it to just be fully the print without that on it. I kind of don't want that. But I don't think they have another one on here that's like that. Let me see if I can find them somewhere else. Shoot. Scarf. Then I also added some jewelry to my car. So I'm about to get these um, bracelets because I need some more silver bracelets. Because I have one. And I have my watch, but I don't have that much silver, like, arm jewelry stuff. So, I want to get some more. I needed some more. And I only got two bracelets. I only got two. And I got a pair of earrings. And, yeah, the rest of it, y'all will see whenever it come in. Um, or y'all will probably see, like, in my birthday vlog and or birthday photo shoot vlog or something like that. Y'all will see it then whenever all the outfits and stuff come together. Because y'all can't see the pieces before it's together you know <laughs> oh my god i'm so excited though even though i don't even have plans for my birthday this type of stuff is what makes me happy like this photo shoot and my pictures coming out like i told y'all taking pictures and stuff makes me happy so this type of stuff is still gonna make me really happy to be all pretty done up and taking pictures and you know like when i be punished on that makes me happy because call me mr put it on <laughs> i'm just kidding but for real that type of stuff makes me happy like fashion clothes make me happy beauty and then i think i think i may want to get my long nails back I really been thinking about what y'all think what y'all think let me know if i should get my long nails back for my birthday because i've really been thinking about it even though i'm gonna start back doing nails i think i want my long nails back just for a split second or should i wait till christmas i'm trying to see if i want to wait till christmas but it's just like i've been itching i've been itching for the clack i haven't heard the clack in a minute and i think you know what i think i said i'll probably never get long nails again I'm going to just start shutting up. I'm going to just be quiet. Because, girl, <laughs> you be lying. <laughs> it's not that I be lying, but that's just how I be feeling at the time. And I just go off how I feel. Because, listen, this is only one. You only get one life. So. And you never know what life going to take you. So. And that's another thing with, like, nails. I wanted to stop. I feel like that's what. I was supposed to do it at that time. I felt like that's what God was saying to stop because it, it wasn't doing it for me no more. You know, it wasn't doing it for me no more. And I stopped. So now I feel like it's like coming back and it's just like, I don't know. I'm going to do, I think I'm going to do like a full video where I'm talking about this, but it's just, I kind of had this feeling where it's just like, you're not done yet. Like, you're not done yet because when I was doing it and when I was getting the feeling like, okay, I think it's like, uh, it's not for me no more and stuff. It's just like, I didn't really have a passion for nails no more. Like doing nails, like going to work and doing my clients nails and stuff. It was just like, ugh, like, oh, I have to do nails. Like it just wasn't doing it for me no more. But I think like the way that I want to go about it this time, I'm going to do it very different. I'm not going to speak too much. I'm not going to speak on it too much. Y'all going to see what I mean soon. But, um, you know, I'm just going about it a different way. And, yeah, because if I say too much, then y'all going to get it. But I'm going to take y'all through all of that, this whole relaunch type thing. Or whatever 
uh this go around because i don't think i really vlogged and stuff that would have been really nice if i had like footage of like when i first started and the whole process of me like learning when i used to practice if i used to vlog back then like when i first started doing nails oh my god that would have been so nice to be able to like look back at when i was sitting i was sitting right here in my room and all i have is this little clear clear acrylic and this little small thing of monomer that i had got from nail by john and i had a brush i ordered a brush some clear acrylic and a little thing of monomer and i was practicing on on my nails to learn i wish i had like footage of all that but oh well um anyways it's like well it's 9 49 it's going on 10 o'clock um i'm kind of getting a little sleepy that's kind of weird that i'm getting a little tired this early because that's not really like me like i be staying up late and that's probably maybe that's why because y'all know i was up to like two three last night Put on a wig for no reason. y'all hey okay so i literally just finished getting ready with y'all kind of seeing like all of that and i didn't even put on the outfit that y'all just seen if i even include that clip because i threw my little outfit on the bed trying to get some nice little clips or whatever and that's not even what i ended up putting on so i put on this boohoo oversized um sweatshirt and then i tied around this fashion over flannel because it is pretty short if i was to just wear it like that so Oh my god, I literally haven't even talked to them since I told them I was going to be back when I said I was getting ready. And I was in my bonnet and nowhere near ready. And then this is my, my comeback right here. Mm. Anyways, I hope that y'all enjoyed the vlog. It, I was supposed to be going out. But I filmed the get ready with me. So y'all will see all that. Y'all will see the fig. Y'all will see everything. I told y'all I was going to show y'all. But everything was literally in the get ready with me. Like perfume, fit, everything. So if you want to see what I look like and watch me get ready to look like this. Then yeah, go watch that video whenever it come out. But y'all going to see this vlog first. But, um, yeah, I hope that y'all enjoyed. This vlog was kind of all over the place. I don't even know how long it's going to be because I don't know if I got a lot of footage. But it was, like, over two weeks, so we're just going to hope so. But, um, yeah, I'll see y'all in the next video.